Hi. Hey guys. Hi, Jafaga. Homely Pop is the winner tonight. I have so many amazing things about myself. Do you want to see my lipstick? It's MAC Cosmetics. Do you want to see my lipstick? It's MAC Cosmetics. Do you want to see my lipstick? It's MAC Cosmetics. My lashes are shooting out. Do you see my hair? I got it at the dumpster at the back of Sally's Beauty Supply. Do you see my outfit? See, it was a red hot fire runway, so I got some orange leaves. Orange is red. And you know what else is fire? Leaves. They catch on fire. Now, once again, I just want to let you know I'm Lady Poison. I love everyone. Namaste, motherfuckers. I fucking won, and I don't know why, but it's okay. I'm, I'm, I like it. I'm okay with it. I was chosen by Homely Pop as her puppet. Sure, she loved having her hand inside of me. I'm excited for Homely. I totally underestimated that bitch. Do you agree with the decision? No. I did not think she was gonna win. No offense and to Homely, but I think she should have won. She's weird, she's out there, she's ugly, and I love it. I look acceptable, I look cheap, I look like a clown, and uh, I was waiting for someone to come in a Hawaiian gig, and someone came in a Hawaiian gig, and they're gone now, so. Aloha. Everybody wants her, Miss Sexy in the City. She's on the prowl, she rocked this town. Who's that girl, a fly ferocious lady? Get up and dance, get up, get up. Ridiculous. Tonight we did the dollar store challenge. <laughs>
how many energy drinks did you have only? Oh. I want you all to say hello to my very favorite burn victim, Victoria Mercy. Oh <laughs> she loves to play dead. And whenever she does something, she always overdoes it, so it's dead anyway. <laughs> I'm surprised she didn't win the challenge. Well, Lady Poison, I'm surprised too. Maybe if I flailed around and had a wardrobe malfunction or two, I'd win. Oh. Oh. You know, I have to bring Ava Dean more back out to say hello to you. How are you, Ava? I'm good. <laughs> How are you, Ava? The other Ava. Here, yeah, I'm Sydney. Sydney, you have that job. I love your costume. Did you have any problems with it? <laughs> Maybe. didn't mention the puppets at all, except for Allegra, and it wasn't positive feedback. I was actually gagged that the judges did not call my ass out. This was my puppet performance. Alright, thanks everybody, have a great night. I worked hard on my puppet. I know, I saw it. Two days. I looked sick I looked yeah, she looked fierce. Had rhinestones, I sprayed that hairline. Girl, that string was stuck to my fingers. <laughs> Every given that we were only given under like pretty much two days, to get this whole setup together. Would have liked to have heard some sort of feedback. So tonight on our dollar store challenge, I decided to give you a little bronze, blonde bombshell beach honey realness. Legit, this is like $6 worth of balloons. This piece took a while. It's basically buffy baseball plushies. More fucking balloons for the corset and then some sparkly shit for birthdays and shit. My titties starting to come off. Bitch, I have over a hundred flowers that I made by fucking hand of tissue paper. That shit breaks when you touch it. I spent hours cutting out all these damn triangles out of paper plates. I'm wearing a fucking shower curtain. I made the whole outfit out of cardboard, duct tape, weird shit. People are gonna tell, but this was actually laundry hamper, fishnet stuff. Realness. It's all spirit gum and duct tape. But they turn on and off, so that's fun. I had capitated Barbies. Started with fucking three shirts, t-shirts, that I crafted into a fucking leotard. I fucking glued Barbies and their dresses onto this. And I'm not creative. Thank you. The judge that said my hair was lazy. Her hair came out of a box, bitch. I was very afraid of Rachel Summers. One of the judge's critiques was from Rachel Summers that I had the mouth of Steven Tyler. I fucking love that. I did get a pretty harsh critique from Miss Rachel Summers, but I was totally expecting it. She's very well known for reading people. There is the stigma in the drag community that being different is not okay, and that everything has to be glitz and glamour and sparkles and rhinestones, and that's just not who I am, you know? Well, luckily for you, yeah. she loved, loved, She loved, loved everything except for my makeup. So tonight, the bottom three included Allegra Williams, Liliana Van Cartier, and Ava Lahore. Ava Lahore was the one who stayed today. We lost Allegra, and we lost Ileana, and I'm actually really kind of sad about it. I mean, I know bitches gotta go home, but it was like really heartbreaking to see all three girls turn it out on stage. <laughs>
Contestant number one had 112. Contestant number two had 115. Me against Ava Lamour. Someone glued a bunch of fucking Barbie dolls to their leotard. You're welcome. Bitch. I came out there, Queen Elizabeth Realness. I'm satisfied with the results. I believe based on tonight's challenge, you did the best. I'm gonna take Ava Lamour, bitch, because she wanted to be here and she looked like it. I had to prove myself. I fucking eliminated two girls. Who else can say that? Two girls. I lost today. I was sent home. Honestly, I'm not surprised. Ileana and Allegra did not hit the mark for me this week. I do agree with who's in the bottom. I don't agree with who went home. I didn't care about who was in the bottom three. I won. This all sucks. And hopefully, they change their mind and decide to bring a bitch back. Do the online voting, and you best bet Allegra Williams will be back. I was happy with everything TBH though. The bottom three deserved it. The top one won, which is me. Went on to the next thing. You suck, Ava. Bye, guys. I guess I'll see you at the reunion. Probably be watching all you fail and fall on your asses. Bye. I'm excited for next week's challenge for the roast and the comedy routine. I'm living for the roast. I don't know if I'm going to roast anybody or do a comedy skit. I'm just going to have a good time watching. I will probably be in the bottom two. I'm going to watch out because I'm, I'm fucking funny. We're ready. We're oh, it's the roast. I'm funny. I won because I'm funny. So I'm going to be funny again. That's nice. I'm excited. I'm sure most of these girls are more excited to get spit roasted, but that's another story. I've been working on my material since day one. Oh, bitch, I cannot wait. I love being on the microphone. I got a little bit of something for everybody, so I will be doing a complete roast of this cast. Who won last week? Oh, I did. Oh, yeah. So we're in it to win it. Top two. Top two. Bye, everyone. You're homely. My cosmetics collection will come for you week after week. Hi. <laughs> See y'all later. Mwah. Still a whore. Bye. Love you. Mwah. I'm a beauty queen from outer space. <laughs> Hold on, I can't do it. Oh, car! Here, here. Oh, car! Oh, Shit, my phone is blowing up. I won! That was a bad one. Use it. Is that my fifty dollars? House down boots. And God, I was just I gonna do hate that. What? What is that? House down boots. The I'm house sorry. down boots. What the, who, whose boots are we talking about? Girl, my boots. My my biscuits. Oh yes, you almost kicked me in the fucking face. Girl, I stole things, so I think I got like twenty eight things for twenty two dollars. But we're not going to talk about that. I didn't mention that. I've heard you like cheap things. Yeah, I think I misunderstood the challenge because I think it was a kind look like contest. Oh! Girl, she's thick though. Ah. Yes. Ooh. Ah. Say bye. Bye. Say it louder. Bye. So angry. <laughs> <laughs>